An Hidalgo County family mourning the loss of a loved one after a fatal accident over the weekend. Channel 5's Monica Deanda spoke with one of the victim's family members. She's in our studio now with more on what they told her. They said they have dealt with heartbreak before. Mary Vargas says her family feels broken. Her cousin Marlena's sudden passing, leaving a hole in their family forever. And unfortunately, this isn't the first time the family has had to deal with a deadly crash. Marlena was a joy and a pleasure to be with. She was very social, had many friends, a loving mother, a very loving daughter, sister, and just about everything. Vargas says her family is still in shock. Late Saturday night on Minnesota Road in Lopezville, DPS investigators say Miguel Lopez lost control of his vehicle and hit the back of a car. The woman driving the car that was hit, 34-year-old Marlena Cantu, was rushed to a hospital where she was later pronounced dead. When I got the call from my cousin, the first thing I heard was her crying and I knew she was gone. Two things Vargas says she will miss the most about her cousin, her smile and sense of humor. She was very funny, loved to joke, you know, she loved to socialize with people and she was well loved and she loved back. Vargas describes Cantu as the rock of her family, a devoted wife, daughter and mother of three. The way her oldest daughter is out there fighting for her mother trying to raise money, that's the way her mother was. She would have done anything for anybody. Today, Miguel Lopez went before a judge. He's facing several charges, including intoxication manslaughter, intoxication assault, and accident involving death. Vargas says Cantu was already in bed Saturday night, but stepped out to take her mother-in-law on an errand. It's really hard losing somebody over somebody's carelessness. Yeah. And it's tragic and overwhelming, and it's very hard, heartbreaking. This accident also brings back tragic memories for the victim's family. Now, they did lose another member of their family to a reckless driver a few years ago. Cantu's mother-in-law was also in the car with her. She suffered just minor injuries. Now, uh, we all, we've also learned more about this uh, Lopez, the man he's been previously charged with driving while intoxicated in 2008. He did plead guilty. In the studio, Monica de Anda, Channel 5 News at 6.